rights of U.S. workers against the need for foreign workers in the Marianas economy with Public Law 115-218. In July this year, the Trump administration helped us convert between 800 to 1,000 people living under administrative parole into Marianas residents with a permanent legal status in the Marianas only. That's Public Law 116-224. Today, HR 560 continues this work of smoothing over the rough places in the application of national immigration law to my isolated district. It provides the same permanent status in the Marianas only, again in the Marianas only, that President Trump approved for parolees in June. This time we want to give stability to a small group of investors who were there even before federal immigration. They have been holding, holding on with short-term visas ever since, never certain from year to year about their business investments. Investments in, of 50,000 initially has grown for many to be large holdings. And we want to give the same certainty to a group of long-term workers and to the businesses that employ them. We held a hearing on HR 560 in February our Republican governor, the Honorable Ralph Torres, testified in favor in support of 560. The Trump administration did not take a position, but their witness noted, and I quote, without a sustained labor force, projected investment in the CNMI likely will wither, end quote. Well, we can do something to avoid that consequence by passing HR 560. Again, this bill is Mariana's only. Chairman Grijalva and Ranking Bishop, Member Bishop are both co-sponsors for which I am very grateful. And I ask all committee members now to vote in favor. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman, and I you back. All right, you talked me into it. Yes. Anyone, uh, any other member wish to uh, to talk about the legislation, to speak to the legislation. Uh, without objection, the ANS offered by Representative Sablan is considered as read and open to amendment at any point. Any amendments to this legislation? The question is now on, on Sablan's ANS to HR 560. All those in favor indicate by saying aye. aye. All those opposed indicate by saying no. In the opinion of the chair, the ayes have it, and the ANS is agreed to. If there is a, what, what now? The question is on adopting HR 560 as amended and order in favor reported to the House. All those in favor indicate by saying aye. aye. Opposed indicate by saying no. In the opinion of the chair, the ayes have it and the bill is favorably reported as amended. The motion to reconsider is laid on the table. Uh, with the cooperation, that's right, get rid of Grijalva. Thank you. 